Hopefully the hiss won't come through too bad here. Uh, I've never seen anybody do this on a lathe. It could be somewhat common practice and I've just never done it. Or I've never come across it. Now, normally you would take a cut uh, and measure that cut and that would tell you where to set your uh, x-axis at. Uh, but I got to thinking about it using the electronic uh, edge finder here. That's a 200 thousandths wide near diameter there. So all I have to do is tell it, touch up against it, and you can see how close I am. Okay. You know, I can just any any little touch there. So I'm I'm right there. Anyway. Uh so the so now I can just go in and tell it that's negative 0.100 uh, and get that. And I was thinking about it, and it's like if I make a collar that basically pushes on here or is held on maybe with a set screw or something like that that so that I could just repeatedly stick it up against the jaws I could measure that with the height gauge and know that from where it mounts to the tip is exactly X amount uh, then I could measure the jaws and I could set my zero according to the face by touching off but I was I was wondering if maybe that just might be a a nice non-destructive way to uh, uh, set tools repeatedly um, without having to you know because especially for uh, setting off tool offsets you know that way you don't have to keep recutting or touching up again I, I don't know it, it's just a thought maybe uh, maybe we'll get some feedback on it and see if it's a lame idea or there's other disadvantages I'm not seeing um, it could simply be too that it's just a whole lot easier to you know get comfortable with doing it the other way. I don't know. Let me know.